pretty gross. Pretty gross. Good morning, guys. It's almost time for the next drift event. The second time there. I cannot wait. Today, I'm going to be changing the, uh, the transmission oil on this car just to make sure that we uh, maintain the transmission and keep it running for as long as we can. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or any suggestions that you want to see, a video that you want to see, or whatever, just leave it down below in the comment section. That's the best way to reach me. For this install, all you need is a 17 millimeter wrench, a torque wrench with a 17 millimeter socket. Also, you're gonna need the transmission oil, brake clean, and a pump. That's about it. It's pretty straightforward. Um, just follow along and you're gonna have no problem. This is the drain plug. It's leaking. And this is the fuel plug. Always remove the fuel plug first because in case you can't remove it later on, uh, at least you still have your old transmission oil inside the transmission case. Open the fuel plug first. Oh, this thing. Have a bucket ready just in case some oil comes out of the fuel plug. Nothing came out. This is the fuel plug. Put it aside. I'm gonna clean this up. Just so the wrench doesn't slip. This is old. Since this is uh, leaking, I should have a new drain plug, but I don't have it. I still want to change the, the oil anyway, and that's what I'm going to do. Let me try to put you guys. Pretty seized in there. If you guys follow the channel at all, you know that PB Blast is needed for all the install on this old rusted little car. See, breaker bar solves everything. This is tight. Okay. Take this out of the way. That's not a lot of oil at all. Just try your best not to get brake cleaner in your eyes, okay? So this is the oil that I'm using, I did my research on it and apparently it was the best choice for the orange sticker. It's pretty stinky to be honest. Alright, it's open, now we just gotta let it drain, put the drain oil, the drain plug back in and put the new oil. Not much left to do, pretty easy job. Clean around it. Put this back. Okay. Torque wrench. Um, from the two places I saw, it was about 30 foot pounds. My torque wrench is an inch pound, so it's about 420. All 
right. One down. One more to go. Now, how do I know it's going to be 0.2 quarts? To be honest, I don't know. So I'm going to fill it up until it starts dripping. Started coming out. So that's how you know it is good enough. I already spilled a lot. foot pounds this is how the old oil looks pretty gross pretty gross all right guys so the oil is changed and it is it it all right guys, so the oil is changed. It is inside a container for me to dispense it AutoZone. Uh, you can dispense it just anywhere. Uh, make sure you take it to the right place. So AutoZone, uh, Walmart, I don't know if Walmart takes it. I know that they take engine oil, but I'll just take it to AutoZone, they take it. And that's pretty much it. If you guys like this video, please hit the like button. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.